Hey everybody, Rugged Elf here. How y'all doing? Um, just wanted to do a quick little video tonight. Um, uh, been getting some comments on my refiner glitch videos that people are having a little difficult time um, getting it to work. So what I want to do is maybe like get a little more in depth on how we make it work and get it, you know, so it works for everybody and everybody can be able to use this thing. So I want to start with the medium one. I may go over to the, um, the little, the portable ones too. But so to get in to this, to make this work, first thing I always do is I want to go in the first person so I can look around. I line myself up right with this middle refiner. Okay. So I'm going to fill the refiner up. So what I want to do, I want to do some storm crystals for our little experiment here. And I want to make some glass. So... Oh, I like glass houses. So once you have them in there, you can go ahead and check. Make sure they're still there. Okay. So once you're lined up, you want to look over. So you want to go into your build menu. And on the controller on PC and on Xbox, you click the B, B button. So you highlight your whatever you want to highlight. And then you're going to hit your right trigger to pick it up and move it. So you pick it up and move it. And the little yellow piece, you see it's all green, but that little yellow piece in the middle. Now see, you want to make sure that these things are lined up. You want them to be about a 90 degree angle to that center refiner, okay? And you're going to let it set off a little bit from it. You don't want to oh, try to get it even with it. And make it difficult to do. So offset a little bit. And that yellow piece is hitting that little cone that's sticking up in the middle of that middle refiner. You set him back down. And you do the same thing with this one. You pick him up. And then you're going to move it over. So that little yellow piece is hitting that cone. Offset a little bit. Not even in the front. Okay. So once you get it there. You know, you'll set him in place. Get out of your build menu. So you come over to this one. You'll open this refiner. And you'll see that the uh, products are in that refiner. Okay? And then to go in and you check this one. And then you have your products are in that right one. Okay? So here. Now I want to do this. I want to go down here. I want to get in a photo mode. Okay? So what we're going to do, I want to show you, is like that little cone, the yellow pieces, you want touching that little cone there in the middle of that. Okay? Now if you look down at the base, the edges, side edges of these are set back a little bit from that front of that refiner. Okay? So I'm going to come up, come over here. If we look down on it, see this uh, one on the right is a little back a little further than the other one. But as long as them cones are touching his back. But you see how these, you know, it's, that refiner is like 90 degrees. Or damn close to it, okay? They're both like 90 degrees to the outside pins of that um, middle refiner, okay? Yeah, I talked too much. It got dark already. So, but um, if you want to, you can check it again. So we'll go into this one. See that the objects are in there. And go in this one. Your objects are in there, right? So you come into this middle refiner. You open that one up. And then you're going to move these over to your suit. Come out of it. When it comes up again, go back into it. And they'll repopulate. 
depending on how fast you do this, these are not going to like instantly show up. As you saw with that one, it took them a second for them to pop back up again. But they normally pop back up again. See how they come in? All right. So once you get what you need and what you want, what you're going to do is go back to your build menu, hit that um, the B button to move, right trigger, move it, move it out of the way, and open it back up again, and you got that. Okay, so when you come out of here, you go back in here. If you look at any of these, everything's gone. So, but if I look into my inventory, you see I have a bunch of other stuff. You know, I did a couple rounds on it, so we got a couple extra piles of glass and storm crystals. Okay, so instead of getting out of the third person, I'm going to stay in here. The small refiners are all are good when you like are starting the game off and stuff, right? Because for me anyway, because you always need the carbon for your multi tool, right? So I come in here. So I'm always going to put carbon in there because that'll increase too. But what you want to duplicate, let's put a couple more storm crystals in here, okay? So we get in there, so we know they're in there. We can double check, okay? So now, same thing. You want to, if you have them in place, you know, you can, you know, if you got them in place, then you can just build menu, B button, right trigger, and you will put this in. Now, these things want to be at, at a little, just like a slight angle. You kind of want those feet um, lined up a little bit, but that little silver band you have in the, you have there, you want them kind of lined up too. Now I'll show you when I get done, and we'll double check everything. So we want to move this one. Get a little bit of an angle, not too much. Some sometimes some people put them at ninety degrees on it. Now, see to me the the smaller refiners is a little more difficult to line up, and they won't always you know it won't work. So if it if shows up in one and not the other, you can just pick that one up and put him back down again. That's too much of an angle. So we want to line them little feet up, line this little these little bars up. Bottom the small I think the small ones are tougher, but you get more out of the medium refiners anyway. But I'll show you. All right, a little bit in there we go, and put him there. Okay, come out of your build menu. So come over here. We'll check this one. So we got our storm crystals and our carbon. So we come over here. We got our storm crystals and our carbon. Okay. So this is what you want to um, line up on this. All right. So we'll go into photo mode. So we'll come in here. You want them, the little feet, kind of almost crossing each other, right? And you see like where the orange goes up and down. You want them almost kind of lined up it's hard to you know it's hard to tell don't want to get too close but you want them like the top orange ones with just that little bit of gap in between them say when you get that gap in between them then you'll be able to come in here and just double check your stuff all right so you come in here, let's pop a couple of these out. So, in your suit, leave, let it show up, open it up, pop it down. All right, now see with these guys, if you got multiple things you want to um, duplicate, right? You can come in here so you can pick this one up. And you see, I'm getting the storm crystals and carbon. And then if I go here, storm crystals and carbon, 
right? So when you look in here, carbon's still in there, but your piece that you duplicated will be gone, okay? So when you look in here now, see I got my two refiners, and now I got 200 extra carbon too, plus my duplicated pieces, all right? So if you want to do multiple things, once you pick them up, you go back into your refiner and anything else different that I might want to not really. <laughs> yeah, let's do a quad servo. So just something different, okay? So then once you get that in there, right? You got that in that middle refiner. You go up to your build menu, and then you come up here, grab your refiner, do your little lineup on the on the legs and the that little them little orange bars, and come up here and you do another one. And here, let me show you something. If you put it back a little bit too far, right, you get that one in here. So. We'll check this one. It's in there. So we check this one. Watch it be there. It is in there. So you got a little bit of play with them. I was trying to set it off a little bit so it didn't. So, But if you go and look, it's in one and not the other, you can pick this one back up again and put him back down. You're not going to lose anything. Okay? And then put it back in place until you get it to where um, you... Um, you know, it shows up in all of them. And that actually holds true for these also, for these medium refiners. If you got them in this one, it's not in that one. You know, you can pick it up and move it. Um, but I've noticed if one's off, it's not going to show up in either end one. So you still have to, you know, move them and redo it again. So it takes a little bit of practice, a little bit of patience, you know, but... It is actually, let's see, it is 6-22-22, okay? So today is um, to Wednesday, Wednesday the 22nd, okay? And this glitch is still working, okay? Here we go. I'm back. We just pop a couple of these out of here. All right, so see, they're showing up, so glitch is working, so once you get done, actually, it's not going to let me, oh yeah, well, I didn't think I had enough room, so pick these two up, and then once I'm all finished, you can leave that carbon in there, but I just like to pop these down, you know, Make it look a little more eh, cool, whatever, you know. So, you finish. Go back in the second person. Uh, we will check the inventory. So, look, I got all these quad servos now. I got all my stuff. And I got 400 pieces of carbon from the small refiner. Okay. You can do two of them in the medium refiner. But you can pick up some carbon or, you know any other refiner and I believe if you put condensed carbon in these when you pick these up it still turns to carbon okay so if you all got any questions let me know um, I hope I was able to answer your questions for you and um, good luck good glitching and hope you all have a great night have a good one everybody thanks